going to show you a quick tip. Uh, for those of you that are part of my syndication group, um, I really need you to understand the power of this. Uh, we talk about making comments and being in the social circle. Well, here's my Google Reader account. Now, you should have set this up um, just like um, I told you in the in the videos. Uh, if you're not 100% um, sure, um, if you visit my website um, and you haven't followed these videos, if you just go up to resources, uh, go to the syndication formula here, um, it it's probably going to take you uh, straight through to the syndication. Here you go. So it takes you straight through to the actual videos on how you can set all this up um, and obviously tools and network and all the rest of it. Um, but I want to show you just how powerful this is. This is actually the syndication group uh, inside the team. Uh, so you'll see here that I've got um, all these different people's feeds. So I've got Carl's feed in there. Uh, I've got, uh, I believe that's Andy and Heidi's feed, Inter's feed, uh, Baz Smith's feed, my feed, Giuseppe's feed, Chris and Susan. And I've got a couple of others, here's, other, other, others in here. But I want to show you just how quick this is. Now, this is um, what's called the um, list view. And you can see everybody's posts just in time and date order. And I can look at who it, who it was. If I want to rename these, um, then I can, uh, you know, so if I want to change one of these out, uh, like that six figure mentors, like for instance, I know that's Andy and Heidi, and I can just go in here, in here, and I can actually change those uh, feed settings if I, if I wanted to. Um, however, what I want to really um, talk to you about the here is this. So I'll go on Carl's uh, latest feed. So this is Carl's latest post, and you can see that I can watch the video straight in here. But the one thing that was missing is that in order to make a comment, I'd have to go across to his website. So that would involve clicking on this link here, open it in another tab, wait for the tab to run up, and of course, you know, blogs tend to be, oh, here we go, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. All right, and I finally get there, and then it allows me to make a comment. Uh, well, I'm going to show you something really super cool. And if you want to know how to do it, hit me up and I'll uh, I'll show you. You'll notice that my reader is a little bit different to perhaps yours because I've got these three links here. So right now I've got this post, um, and if I click this link here, link, it will actually go out and it will bring Carl's website right into Google Reader. And here it is. So now I can just scroll to the bottom. This is um, an iframe. So it's essentially Carl's uh, page on my Google Reader account. And I can put in here my name, Mark. Yeah, so I put in my name. Uh, put in my email. Put in my website. And then I can make a comment. Um, all right, so that would be my comment as an example. And then all I've got to do is literally hit the submit button and it's done. Okay? How quick, how quick is that? So once I've finished with Carl, I can just go to Baz, go across to Baz, do exactly the same. Bring in Baz's site. Oh, there you go. So I'm in Baz's site here. And I can just go straight down and yet again make a comment. Okay. Etc, etc. All right, so this is really, really <laughs> really powerful. Um, good tip. Hope this helps you guys. Take care.